Hey guys, it's Rochelle. Welcome back. So today I wanted to review a lipstick that I got in my Ipsy bag this month. So this month I got Noya Natural Lipstick in the color Current News. Current as in the fruit current. So this is what it looks like. It looks very purple, right? So I know it's a little dark for me, but we'll try it. It might be a nice color. So this there's really no distinct scent other than smelling like lipstick. So that's not really a great thing, but it's not a bad thing either, right? So now according to the Noya.com website, this has things like um, shea butter and vitamin E. So, so that's good. It should be nice and hydrating on the lips. Hopefully it'll feel nice going on. Uh, it doesn't say anything about the staying power, so I'm not sure about that. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I received, let's see, this is a 1.4 gram sample. On the website, it's 4.5 grams for $18. So not that high, um, but you really have to like it in order to make that that price really worthwhile. Now, one, one thing that might matter to you is that the packaging is made out of bamboo. Right, so bamboo is a very renewable source. So if that matters to you, the $18 price tag may not be that bad after all. So let's try this and see. I don't know how it's going to be with my skin tone. It's a little dark for me, but we'll give it a shot. You never know. Might be a good Halloween color, right? Halloween's coming up. So that's one swipe. And it's really dark. But it feels really nice. Smooth. It's not tugging on my lips any. This is really making me wish that I got, um, that I received like a lighter color, you know, because it does come in, you know, everything from reds to pinks. So I wish I would have received more of a pink color or I think they have like a, a desert rose or something like that. So that may have been a little better for me. I always find it so hard to get good lines with uh, with such dark colors. The lighter ones are so much more forgiving. <laughs> Just like that. You know, though, this is this isn't bad at all. So I thought it was going to be more purple. Look, it the application it applies more red than purple. So. I'm not one to wear a bold color like this uh, daily or during the day. This would be a little uh, a little too bold for me, being so fair. But if I was to be getting ready to go out to a party or out dancing with my friends, I would definitely wear a color like this. Now I'm not sure about the staying power, so let's see. Let's see if it passes the teacup test. Oh, that's a lot of transfer. The, the color is really saturated. Let's see if we can lighten this up just a little. Yeah, so it's, you know, like I said, I, I would wear it to go out. Um, the, the formula seems nice. So I don't know if I would pay, pay the price to try another color. Maybe I'll wear this today and see if the staying power makes it worth it. I would hate to ha to spend that kind of money on a product that I would have to keep applying and keep applying. That kind of doesn't make sense to me. It's a waste of a product. But it does look nice. It feels nice. And uh, I, I would give it a thumbs up. I, I would try it. So if, you, if you've tried this product and you've tested it for its staying power, you know, let me know how that did. And uh, let me know what color you tried. I would love to try others, but I want to see what what you're getting, you know. So anyway, I'm off to work, guys. You have a great time, a great day, great time, a great day. And I will see you back here next time for the next review. Have a good one. Bye.